This news highlight is brought to you by Bonnie Post Online. Two varsity students killed in road crash. On April the 13th, four university students who were traveling in a Proton Satria heading to their campus at Kota Samarahan were involved in an accident along KM 26 Jalan Kuching Sirian around 6.40 a.m. The driver was believed to have lost control of the vehicle and rammed into the safety railing at the roadside. Two lost their lives while two of their friends were in critical condition. Jellyfish washed ashore in Samatan Beach. Businesswoman Angela Ng saw about 50 jellyfish on the beach when she went to Samatan on April the 13th. She stated that the invertebrate she saw was somewhat transparent, had a slight bluish tint, and about the size of a serring wheel. Fisheries Research Institute senior researcher Daud Awang described the scene as something normal and was nothing alarming. He said jellyfish tend to end up on beach due to the act of fishermen on traditional sampans or trawlers. Jellyfish accidentally caught by traditional fishermen on sampans usually ended up back into the sea. The dead jellyfish were then carried to the shore by high tide. Lorry driver shot on way to work. E. Ko Hong, a lorry driver, was shot on his right shoulder near his workplace at Lane 4, Tang Kung Sok Road, Cebu, about 7.30 a.m. on April the 15th. He managed to ride on his motorcycle to a factory nearby where his friends called for an ambulance. The factory supervisor said he heard an explosion followed by the revving of motorcycles speeding away. He then realized Yi was shot when he saw him bleeding from the right shoulder. They rushed Yi to Cebu Hospital where he was reported to be in a stable condition. Kapal Singh, personal assistant, died in road accident in Kampar. Former DAP chairman and Bukit Galugur members of parliament, Kapal Singh, died in a road accident on the North-South Expressway near Gua Tempurong in Kampar on April the 17th. Kapal Singh's personal assistant, identified as Michael Cornelius, was also killed in the 12.40 a.m. accident. Both the deceased died on the spot at KM 306.1 on the northbound stretch of the highway. Kapal Singh's maid was badly injured while his son, Ram Kapal Singh, and the driver of MPV they were traveling in were unhurt. Three dead, 292 missing in ferry sinking. South Korean rescue teams raced to find nearly 300 people missing after a ferry sank with 459 on board, mostly high school students bound for Holiday Island on April the 16th. The Vice Minister of Security and Public Administration said 164 people had been rescued, while 292 were yet to be found. His office said there were three confirmed deaths, including a female crew member and a student. Survivors wrapped in blankets were taken to a gymnasium on nearby Jindo Island, where a number of tearful parents had already arrived. Three giant floating cranes had been dispatched to the site and would begin operations to raise the submerged vessel.